an imitation. It ain't right. It ain't natural. It can save your life. No, you lose more than what gets left behind in the chopping block. You should know this by now. Criticize. Some sightings natural. I understand. But technology, it's different now. It can help you. You could still live a normal life. A normal life? What would you know about a normal life? Did technology really help you, Jensen? I think... I think it made you a monster. Sarath didn't give you your life back. He just made you better at taking it away from others. I don't think you really want to die, Radford. I think you're just scared. I was scared too. I didn't ask for any of this, just like you didn't ask for a bullet in the gut. But you can't blame me, or Seraph, or technology for what's happening here. I wouldn't be in this mess if it wasn't for you and your damn past. I never should have taken the job, but I needed the work, the money. Even if I wanted to, I can't afford the fucking augmentation surgery. And I can't, I can't live like a cripple for the rest of my life. Living through adversity is what makes us human. It's not flesh and blood or even bone that defines us. I might be more machine than flesh, but I'm still alive. I'm still human. You got heart. For a robot, I'll give you that. Tell you what, I'll play along with this little after-school special you got going on here. I'll get through this, but not, not because of this lovey-dovey bullshit charade. <laughs> I'll live for the truth, for revenge. Whoever hired those suits, I'm going after those sons of bitches. I don't care how deep this rabbit hole goes glad to hear it yeah yeah and jensen i don't know how bad you think your wounds were but your boss your friend Sarif, they butchered you went too far with the operation you were an experiment a test but he's the one that made you a weapon Almost makes me feel bad for you. Almost. Shit. Son of a bitch. Richard, I located Radford. He was attacked by men in suits. Private security, secret service types. I'm going after them. What about Radford? Did you get anything out of him? He's in pretty bad shape. You need to call it in, get an ambulance to his apartment stat. Got it. And Jensen, don't get yourself killed, okay? Oh, Francis. I didn't know you cared. Don't flatter yourself. I care about the security of this company. You getting yourself killed compromises that. So don't be stupid. Look at him. Draw me like one of your French girls, huh? <laughs> and the bank. Of course he is. I know Mr. Da Mr. Gray is landing tonight. We're working on it, yeah. Da Dara? Listen, believe me, we tried. The old man proved resilient. And we left someone behind to watch him. And if we need, we can go back, but I'm not sure how much more he can take. That's why we need Smith. We tried that already. Look, he can't get the safe open. That's why if you could, Send Smith down. 
Right. Thank you, sir. Now we'll contact you as soon as we have the information. Secretary, I'm phoning you with Mr. Grace Travel. Continue re, re it's imperative you to retrieve Tip off the target or Seraf. I trust you exercise your diligence on this matter and be done before Mr. Gray reaches Detroit. Welcome aboard Singapore, Prague. to reach me huh what Stop the hell is that son of a bitch i thought had energy left ah damn it god stupid fucking battery Such a fucking idiot right now. Let's try it again stealthily. Now, what we could also do is use. The typhoon on these fuckers. Alright. So let's wait till the fucking battery recharges to full. And we can actually use this thing. I think it was F3 typhoon. I am not mistaken. Let me check activate Typhoon F2. Huh? Stop it! of the cops. Try it again, I'm not used to Typhoon. <laughs> I have to use another pack to get those behind those the skies safely. Quietly.
chat. Surprised you can't actually take a non-lethal takedown without at least one battery. Collection of pictures from your childhood. To Megan by her grandmother. General Manager Michael Barris could not be reached for comment, but a pre-recorded message he had left on what he leaks slept all free in line, laps toll free line, stated that nobody's believed to have heard been heard in the fire. That message was later removed when the firefighters began pulling bodies from the wreckage. The recovery operations are currently ongoing, Fire Chief Miyakin told the reporters, but also stated that the circumstances behind the blaze were very suspicious. White Helix Labs, a subsidiary of Versa Life, is a biosearch firm studying childhood genetic diseases. So I guess the true stuff is on this machine here. Well, let's hope uh, my hacking skills are decent. Jensen Psych Evaluation, this is good work, Brent. Keep it up. You wrote Mr. Seraf, I found Adam Jensen Psych Profile Evaluation following that SWAT incident with the augmented teen. I managed to sneak in a look at these folders, but I couldn't copy it, at least not yet. I'll be honest with you, Psych Love. This is a pretty pretty picture. It mentions the problems with authority figures, disregard for the chain of command, anger management issues, and potential PTSD. Here's the thing. When you hired me, you said you wanted me to read between the lines, so here it is. The evaluation reads like fiction. I'm thinking a pissed off superior wanted Jensen off the force, and he had the evaluation worded to read just like the, to read like just cause. But most of the rank and file I spoke to respected and liked Jensen. They thought he was a real straight shooter, and even though the SWAT incident sourced his, shored his reputation a little, still, even my source didn't like him enough to want to keep his psych. Evaluation buried. Rent. Here's a little nugget I gleaned off the PC of your man's bow. Expo. Bureau. Whatever. I was hoping to get more on some, but some nuclear snake was haunting my trace and I had to jump the networks. I tried to reconnect. My tunnel was caved. Whoever that was, they're good. I'm not gonna risk going back in anytime soon. Consider my debt paid. This is the last time I do a job without the money up front. <laughs> <laughs> 